Hello guys, welcome back to World News Channel today. BHT slash ISWAP terrorists on the run as troops intensify offensive operations. In continuation with the war on terror, the well-motivated and gallant troops of 7th Division and Sector 1 Operation Lafayette Dole OPLD have continued to effectively stage ambushes and other successful offensive operations against the BH and ISWAP terrorists within the sector's AOR area of responsibility. This laudable effort has been reflected in several successful ambushes and fighting patrols conducted by units within the sector's AOR in line with the directive of the Chief of Army Staff for all sectors to dominate and maintain aggressive offensive posture against the terrorists in the ongoing operation Cantana Jimlan. In compliance with the order, on the 11th of May 2020, troops of Army Super Camps 6 and 7, led by the commanding officer of 222 Battalion, Konduga, conducted a series of long-range fighting patrols on identified and suspected terrorist hideouts along Azungi and adjoining localities. No contact was made as the terrorists fled the villages on sighting the troops. However, troops found a wooden boat in Azungi village and destroyed it. The following items were also recovered, two motorcycles and one Lister grinding machine. Similarly, based on intelligence, troops of Strong Response Area, SRA, Polka, on the 13th of May 2020, in collaboration with Civilian Joint Task Force, and hunters successfully staged an ambush operation at a well-known terrorist crossing point along Puka to Boko to Kirawa Road. The ambush resulted in the death of eight BHTs while others fled in disarray with bullet wounds, ten bicycles, assorted food items and some items of intelligence value were recovered. Also, on the 15th of May 2020, Troops of 192 Battalion in a night ambush operation came in contact with BHTs that are obviously relocating from Sambisa Forest to Mandara Mountains. The troops swiftly engaged the terrorists and five of them met their Waterloo and three AK-47 rifles with one of the rifles loaded with 17 rounds of 7.62mm special ammunition a bar containing a pair of BHC Special Forces uniform, two cartridges, and other clothing materials were captured. Similarly, on the 18th of May 2020, troops deployed at RSA Gajigana unleashed heavy fire in response to BHC's attack on their location. Immediate reinforcements by troops from 7th Division Garrison and 195 Battalion conducted swift exploitation with troops of SRA Gajigana along the terrorist withdrawal route and captured two AK-47 rifles, 37 round, 36 rounds of 7.62mm special ammunition, three magazines, two by 36 hand grenades, and one LG-3 bomb. In subsequent exploitations operations following the Gajigana attack, combined troops from 7th Division Garrison 195 212 battalions and members of the vigilante group carried out exploitation mission forward of Gajigana and Ambudu Axis on 19th and 20th of May 2020, which led to discovery of the following five dead terrorist bodies, seven AK-47 rifles, two gun trucks, one anti-craft gun, six assorted magazines, 250 rounds of 12.7 mm anti-aircraft ammunition, 61 rounds of 7.62 mm special ammunition and seven and two by 36 hand grenades, while one technophone, one flash drive, one SIM card were also recovered. In a related development, troops deployed at Dikwa under 22 Brigade on 19th of May 2020 neutralized two terrorists and inflicted injuries on several others who attempted to attack their location from Boboche Axis. With the support from Quick Response Force led by the acting commanding officer, the terrorists were overpowered and they ran for their lives. And the underlisted items were recovered one AK 47 rifle, one 
magazine with 50 rounds of 7.62 mm special ammunition. Additionally, on the 21st of May 2020, troops of 22 Brigade, specifically its 1 Division Task Force Battalion and 153 Task Force Battalion, in collaboration with CJTF, carried out a victorious operation along Mugdala village. During the operation, troops exchanged fire with fleeing terrorists and neutralized eight of them. Also, the troops destroyed terrorist hamlets, food items, clothing and utensils, and captured one AK-47 rifle, one dang gun, three BHT's flag, two bicycles, two techno cell phones, two gig memory card, and other cell phone accessories. In another encounter, troops of 202 Battalion and 21 Special Armored Brigade Garrison, Bama, on the 22nd of May 2020, acting on credible intelligence, laid an ambush at identified BHT's crossing point along Bama, Olari Road. Consequently, troops neutralized three terrorists while others escaped with gunshot wounds and the underlisted items were recovered. 10 liters of PMS, two bicycles, one solar panel charger, and assorted stuff. In summary, during the period under review in Sector 1 OPLD, a total of 35 BHT slash ISWAP terrorists have made their water low, and several others fled with gunshot injuries. Wow. Kudos to the Nigerian Army. So guys, if you have anything to say concerning this, drop your comment in the comment section and don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Thank you.